students today we discuss about our project variable power supply using lm317 so this is our circuit diagram so what are the component major components of the circuit transformer range selector dpt switch as well as one zero selector switch as well as lm317 ic in5408 diodes for rectifier circuit uh, we use four diodes in5408 as well as two potentiometer as well as resistor and the capacitor we will use these are the component list these are the component list what is the working principle of this uh, project this is the working principle for example we give the ec supply 230 volt it uh, convert in 20 volt ac not convert step down the step down 20 volt ac can be convert dc using rectifier circuit uh, the dc voltage based on we are selecting the dptt switch as well as we are changing the zero zero selected switch as well as we can adjust the potentiometer we will get a variable power supply from 1.5 to 40 volt we will get a different uh, supply in each test point okay now the same circuit we will draw in the simulation software the software name is called as uh, circuit wizard in the software we can draw it and uh, simulate it so actually this go to file new okay. so based on this um, circuit we will take the components and draw the circuit we open this software circuit wizard if you see here gallery as well as uh, assistant is there Gall gallery you can open if you want power supply just take click click here click here click here and uh, take the power supply draw as well as here the range is we, we can put it 230 and 230 to 50 as well as we want the uh, switches dpst switch we want DPTST switch, take DPST switch also. What switch you want, uh, we can select. We want delete, just right click and delete. We want to change the position, just right click, arrange. Yes. We, if you want a diode, just go and uh, click diode. Select diode. To rotate, just arrange, rotate. So you see the all the diodes are 5408 just click double click here 5408 IM 5408 select the diodes next if you want the LED output components LED so LED which color you want suppose you want red color select red you want green color select green the red select red color okay. as well as the uh, as well as transistor if you want transistor go and select transistor so this is actually pnp transistor select right click arrange yes the name of the transistor is tap127 just click put the put the name select the name TAP actually this is a TAP transistor TAP1277 all the name list are there which transistor just select okay if you want a resistor go to check the resistor resistor you want take potentiometer you want take as well as capacitor you want capacitor take capacitor you want to give the capacitor values 100 microfarad just click type 100 microfarad You want to give the resistor 1k 10k mean 10k as 
as well as potential meter 2.5k 2.5 so like that based on the diagram you take the component okay if you want connect the testing point just take test point take test point and it will keep it connector sockets so whatever connector you want just take and keep the connector also now we want to make the connection just click this point like this like this for this is the example this is the example so like that just you can draw base around the circuit just you can make the draw okay just to make the draw you will get the circuit like this circuit like this this is our circuit okay, this is our circuit if you see here transformer connector transformer AC supply is given diode for diode for convert circuit DPDT switch the TLM 317 2 potentiometer capacitor as a resistor zero selector switch so based on this diagram we draw this diagram now we will go the simulation okay now we will go the simulation okay, this is normal this is a voltage level this is the current level logic level standard mode first go to click this one the simulation will becomes okay so switch is on now you see here the switch the dpt connected between this point 3 and 1 4 and 2 you will get a voltage at the range of 20 as well as you change here this zero sector switch will get a voltage 0 But we are changing this one. You will get up to 40. You will get up to 40. Your voltage will be increase. Here 0. Voltage will be increase up to 40. So based on this selector, it will be change. As well as we go to voltage level. So each and every point, how much voltage it will be shown. This is the diagram of voltage flow so each and every point how much voltage it will be shown okay. each and every point suppose we are adjusting this point this one now adjusting the voltage level is more 4.9 now again change it the voltage level is very less we are changing potentiometer we are changing the voltage see the voltage level is 26 the voltage level is 23 so based on this adjusting potentiometer the voltage will be changed based on adjusting this switch as well as this switch the voltage will be changed next we go to current flow this is the current flow diagram so we are changing the switch the current flow direction will be changed see so let's see here the current flow direction will be changed so let's logic level this is a logic level so based on based on the switch position the logic level will be changed 1 and 0 logic level will be changed check the each and every test point also this is the standard okay so this is a nice um, software to draw any simulation circuit to simulate it and uh, obtain the voltage so here this is the voltage probe just to connect wherever we want voltage 
just uh, connect the voltage bro and um, and check the voltage current